Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 19th of February 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, create your future and transform your present. Raise your consciousness, remember why you are here. Take that step on your spiritual path, come out of that spiritual closet to find out who you truly are and fulfill your life purpose in this lifetime. Now, this week we're going to be using Earth Magic Oracle Cards by Stephen D. Farmer. But as always, before I get started, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you, I'm truly blessed and grateful. And with that in mind, um, I'm gonna be teaching Angelic Craigie again this year. So um, on the 16th and 17th of March, I'm going to be um, teaching Angelic Craigie one and two. So if you wanna start your journey of connecting with the angels or even getting a deeper connection with the angels and the angelic realms, um, and want to be able to heal with the angels and find out more about yourself and the angels, then do check out um, the training and it'll be lovely for you to join me here in Dartford. And of course, in April, I am going to be running the retreat down in Glastonbury. So again, you know, if you want to find out more about yourself to heal your past, create your future and transform your present, as well as connecting with all the beautiful energies down in Glastonbury, um, then please do check it out. And I'd love to you to join me and uh, the others um, down in Glastonbury. So as always, I give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. So what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 19th of February 2024? What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 19th of February 2024? Okay, so let's see what three cards want to come out. And of course, if you're looking um, for a little bit more clarification, then this Thursday, the 22nd, um, I will be doing the Angels and Spirits show with Graham Williamson, where we do mini readings for you. So um, if you're interested, uh, do look out for that on Facebook and YouTube. So the cards that came out this week are Mountain, Strength, Lotus Flower, Unfoldment, and Wind activation okay so what the cards are saying to me this week is that know you have the strength within you you have the strength to be and do whatever you want to be or do in this lifetime you are that mountain you know you are that energy that you know that that that, that stands strong you know, that has that majestic, that power, that this is me, this is who I am. I am the most beautiful human being and I am here to stay. I am here for the long haul. I have the strength within me to achieve and do anything I want to do. And this is a week of actually stepping into that strength, into that, into that power and knowing that you have the strength, um, you know, no matter what gets thrown at you um, in, in the world, in your personal life, any chaos, um, any anger, any energy, you know, any wind, rain, you know, whatever it is, know that you are like a mountain, you know, you have the strength, you can weather that storm, no matter what is going on around you. And you'll find that as you're standing in that strength, are standing strong, things start to unfold around you and they start to unfold so that you know what is going on. You can understand where and why these things are happening and you can know and understand how you can deal with them and you can move on from them or utilise them for your highest good to help you move forward and further in your life. And it may be that things will come to, that you'll find out things that you never knew existed or there might be secrets or stories that 
you were never aware of that are going to come to light this week. But if you're stand, you stand in the strength of your own truth and knowing and power, these things that are revealed will not knock you down. They will not knock you back. They will give you the strength and the understanding that you know so that you can move forward. And they will give you the impetus to move forward, you know, to actually take the act, um, to take the action to actually go beyond these things, um, to actually bring things into your life, to move forward, to take that action. Okay, I've been, this has come, you know, this is, I now understand what this is. So this means because of this, I can go this way now. Or, okay, that, what I've, what's been revealed to me here means I, 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 know I now need to not go in that direction, but I now need to go in another direction and take the action to do that. You know, this is a week of activation, of doing what you're being guided and led to do that will be a benefit to not just you, but to the wider community, to the wider world as, as well. So you'll also find that you'll have this week, if you... When, when you're standing in that strength, in that, in that power, if you tap into it, you'll also find that you'll be given the whispers, the nudges that will uh, um, push you forward, which will actually help you with that activation, with taking the action. So be aware of those. Um, look out for them. Know that they are there and be ready for them when they come in. So that's really all the, um, the cards are saying to me this week. Yeah, as, as always, when I draw these cards, I draw them for what you need to know for your highest good. So it may be that one particular card stands out more than the others, or it may be that you get your own message, and that is absolutely fine. And if you do get your own message, or a card stands out more, or my reading resonated, then please do let me know in the comments or message me privately, as I always reply to everyone um, who comments. So the cards again are mountain and strength. Know that you have the strength. You know, you are that mountain. Stand steady. Stand firm. Know you have the strength to weather any storm, anything that happens, you will come out at the other end. And allow, and notice for unfoldment, and allow things to unfold, you know, don't try and fight things that are unfolding. If things are being revealed to you this week, listen to them. Allow them to resonate with you, to sink in. But don't react to them. Just understand them and know that you can move on from them and they can actually be used of benefit to you. And wind activation you know, allow yourself to be guided, to hear those whispers, to move forward, to take that action um, so that you can actually um, improve your life and the life of those around you, the community, and know that things are moving in the right direction this week. So I hope that makes sense. As I said, please do let me know um, in, in the comments about that. And as I said, don't forget to check out the Angelic Crakey training. You know, I'm doing one and two in March, three and four in April and June. We're doing the practitioners. So you can do one, do two, do all three. You can even go on and do the master teacher if you want. And, you know, when I did Angelic Crakey, it really changed my life um, and set me on a completely different path. It is absolutely amazing modality. And of course, going down to Glastonbury, what more could you want to help you um, get clarity on where you are, where you're going and have a wonderful, relaxed, chilled out time. Um, and don't forget to check out my show Angels and Destiny, which is taking place um, tomorrow, the 19th at 8 p.m. UK time. Um, and if you're watching this on Monday, the 19th, and it's taking place today. And if you're watching later in the week, then please do watch the replay. And my guest is going to be the lovely... Um, Karina Shah. So I'm really looking forward to having that conversation with her. And of course, Thursday, Graham and I will be doing our angels and spirits show. So 
do come along and join us and um, say hello say you'd like a reading and um, Graham will do his mediumship psychic and I'll do a card for you um, with what you need to know for your highest good. Have a wonderful week. Take care and speak soon. Bye.